Hello kids and cadets, welcome back to Tommy Time. Today I am working on my 2003 GMC Sierra SLE with the 4.8 liter V8 engine. Today I'm swapping out the fan clutch. The original fan clutch is slipping. There's little resistance on the clutch, so I went ahead and got a new one. I happened to be on a Zoom meeting this morning with my family and was discussing it with my brother Rob in Phoenix. And I was unaware that the fan clutch has a liquid material inside that heats up and allows the fan clutch to engage. This one's nice and tight. The original one I could move with no resistance. So, there's a fan shroud that goes over all of this. So I remo remove the, the top radiator hose, move that to the side, remove the top plastic shroud which is attached with six of these pop-up clips. You just take a screwdriver and pop up this clip and the whole thing releases. So there's six of those that hold the um, the top plastic fan shroud down. Then you remove the intake boot here and then you have full access to your project. There's several different ways of holding down your main water pump pulley. I tried to use a gigantic pair of channel locks and wrap it around the pulley these were just not big enough so there's another way you can do it and I use the uh, clamp method I remove this one one roller pulley to have more access and so I used a piece of cardboard clamped down on the pulley and wedged it up against the water pump to keep it from moving and then used um, a pipe wrench on the main nut here to, to get it off. That was the hardest part is getting off the um, the main clutch nut here. What I should have done is sprayed it first with moose piss and let it sit and I didn't do that because the original one was rusty right around here. So there's a story behind moose piss and I'll explain myself. Moose piss is a short term name or a nickname for this PB blaster. I've had this can in my right hand for years and this is what the new can looks like. New design but same great formula. It's a penetrating spray. I've used the heck out of this stuff and I'm nearly empty on the original can. A, long, a little bit goes a long way. So how it got the nickname Moose Piss, my friend Robbie, who was a B-17 pilot in, in World War II, gave it that nickname. He was a great me mechanic, a great handyman, tinkerer like myself, into Volkswagen Beetles. That's how I ended up meeting him. I had a Beetle at the time that stopped running. And he, uh, he and I rebuilt the engine. So I was working at his shop at the time, helping him on the, the side, working on my own vehicle. And he 
said grab that can of moose piss and I had no inkling to what the heck moose piss was. Come to find out it's PB Blaster. And I guess it could pass for moose piss. I'm sure moose piss is kind of strong and has a dark coloring to it. PB Blaster is the same way. Anyway, that's the little ditty on moose piss. Great stuff. I recommend this over anything in the penetrant world. So that's where we are at. I was able to get the old clutch off and what I'll do is you reuse the uh, fan blades. There's four bolts holding on the the uh, fan blades to the clutch mechanism. So I'll remove these four four bolts and go ahead and bolt on the the old blades onto my new Korean clutch. So I really haven't done too much maintenance on this truck. I've had it for a couple of years and concentrated on the brakes. The brake lines were severely rusty. This truck happened to spend four or five years in South Dakota. That's why you see all this surface rust on all the nuts. If it was a Florida truck, you wouldn't see any of these surface rust all around. So, now's a good time to check all your pulleys. Make sure there's no play in the pulley. They're all nice and tight. Spin your bearings. Listen for any grinding. Make sure everything's spinning freely. I notice I'm due for a, another belt. The underside of the belt has a bunch of cracks in it and the AC belt further down that's all cracked up. The the um, hoses all have a production date of March of 2003 so these are all the original hoses. I'm going to order the upper hose and the lower hose and two belts, the AC belt further down and the main serpentine belt need to be replaced. So this was a good opportunity to see what I need to concentrate on for maintenance. So I'll go ahead and put an order together and get all this stuff and put it on. But for the time being, I'm going to do the uh, clutch and see if it helps me out in the uh, cooling. I just had the AC serviced by a friend of mine and he's the one that noticed the the uh, clutch, fan clutch was uh, free spinning. So anywho, kinda took a break today from the mowers and decided to do some truck servicing today. I appreciate you kids and cadets coming out, listening to my moose piss story, and checking out the fan clutch replacement. I hope you guys have a great day today, and as always, thanks for coming out and checking out Tommy Time.